Hi everyone, welcome back to Chemology DIY, where we're on the last few days before Christmas, so we're getting the property ready to have guests. It's been windy, and we have all these branches laying all over the yard, and we're about to have Christmas here in a few days, so we're gonna pick those up. So come along and let's do some yard work. All right, so here is the side-by-side. -side. We don't use it all the time, and it actually needs a new battery. That's something I'm gonna get after Christmas. I spent a lot of time, energy, and money getting stuff for the little ones, so I'll get a new battery soon. However, I just need to charge it right there. I have it off because I was gonna plug it in earlier, and I forgot, so let's do that. So this is the battery charger. Um, since I'm leaving the house, I have learned from other friends who've had their, you know, garages catch on fire and their cars catch on fire. I'm not gonna plug this in while I'm gone. So I'm just gonna get it set up and ready to go. And then I'll plug it in when I get back. There's certain things that my dad told me a million times not to do. One of those things was leave things plugged in. gas has been acquired it's back there you can see it back to the house because we got some mowing to do and some branches to pick up the weather is beautiful it's a cool 69 degrees in Florida that never happens so I'm grateful and I'm gonna do as much outdoor side work yard work as much outdoor yard work as I can get done before the Sun goes down so stay tuned in my extension cord. All my settings should be exactly where I want them to be. And let's plug it in. Okay, yes, this battery 100% needed to be charged. Look at that. Yikes, very low. So we'll charge it, and we'll get the gas. Here's my reservoir garden bed. The plants, ooh, they need a little bit of uh, fertilizer, looks like, yeah. These bell pepper plants I need to trim back. They actually didn't do very well in this reservoir garden bed. However, the jalapenos and the banana peppers thrived so far. Oh, look at the little jalapeno turning red. 
can see there's some fruit on here right now. So we need to fertilize this bed. That's what's going on here. So we'll fertilize it really good. The rosemary is growing. That's not planted in there, but once I take out these bell peppers and move them, I'll, I'll plant this in there because it's actually loving that little spot. And I just fill it up until I see water coming out of here. So here's my intake. The hose is in there. I've got a little light right there so you can see it in the dark. I haven't filled this up in about a week because I've been really busy with Vlogmas, so. These are my chives. They're loving it. They like it in here a lot. Yeah, so there's the trellis. The other one's over on the other side and we're gonna finish up probably after Vlogmas. And then we'll show you guys exactly how that works. So we just sit here and wait for the water to come out of the outtake. Oh, look at this. Look at this banana pepper. Look at that. Look at it in comparison to my hand. I mean, it's quite, quite nice. Let's release the little lizard. He must have been trapped in there. Here you go, bunny. Actually, I'll pour the water into the reservoir. turn off the water before I do that I actually put this under here to collect all the extra water and then I water the other plants with this all right let's get this baby out of here it's heavy I'm gonna need two hands okay the gas is in I definitely spilled some so according to my theory this thing just didn't have gas and needs to be charged because the battery is bad. Keys in. Wow! 